I would like to come on the job. Best one done. The most memorable is someone gave me a dildo one time to use. <laughs> I used it on Guido. We're here at Milano's Pizza in Long Island, New York, and we're gonna take our first bite and we're going to give this a grade. So here we go. You know me, I love New York pizza. It's got a good mm. taste to it. I'm gonna give this a 9.2. I think that's a good grade. Alrighty guys, this is the room that we're staying at here for the big event in New York tomorrow. Here's the bathroom. Nice little bathroom there. Of course, I gotta rep Rhea Ripley because I'm gonna be meeting her tomorrow. Very excited. And over here we got the mirror as well. Looking good. We got some VR wrestling stickers on the phone. <laughs> nice little closet right there. And here's the room. And over here, we got the Celtics and the Nets on in-season tournament game. Brooklyn Nets fan, got to watch the team, got to support them. And we also got a desk, which I am going to be recording a figure review because I did go on a toy hunt while I was out here. And I even got my fiance, a nice little Squishmallow as well. And I'm going to be doing a review because I found a really cool store. That's going to be over on my personal channel there where I do my toy stuff. And we got a nice little desk here. I'm honestly not gonna lie, this is one of the best desks I've seen. The next day. What is up? We are Wrestling Maniacs out there worldwide. I'm the host with the most. Mr. We Are Wrestling himself, the best one, Donnie, here. With my dad in the background over there. You wanna say what's up to the We Are Wrestling Maniacs? What's up? Today we're going to the big event, New York. We went to the last one in March. If you haven't checked that vlog out, recommend you guys to. It was jam-packed, but today we have an even more jammed pack event. If you're not a We Are Wrestling Maniac yet already, and you're not a part of the thousands of subscribers, we recommend you to hit that subscribe button now, turn on the post notifications, videos be coming out of nowhere, like an RKO, and of course you already know, the grind is real. And, oh man, what a day we have here. We're going to be meeting a lot of AEW stars. We're going to be meeting Mommy. And we're going to be meeting a lot of former WWE stars and legends. And I'm very excited for this event. Always looking forward to the big event in New York. And this time it's in Long Island at the hotel. It was very, very chaotic. So hopefully this time around we have better luck but yeah, guys, look at that. We got the We Are Wrestling shirt on, which will be available pretty soon. So stay tuned for more updates on that. And if you don't, if you haven't listened to the We Are Wrestling podcast, new episodes are coming out every Saturday over on the YouTube channel or wherever you listen to your podcast. So download the episodes because we're really trying to grow on the audio platform as well. But guys. I hope you enjoy the big event New York vlog. Let's get it. Oh guys a whole lot of figures we're getting signed today Woo! jam pack plus we got the paint markers always got to be prepared baby and we also got more figures right here let's move that out of the way even got dennis rodman's jersey got a 
bunch of bunch of figures here. Oh, we're ready, baby. Many, many minutes later. We got a whole lot of stuff, man. Look at this cart filled with wrestling figures. We even got Jersey, we even got some Funko Pops. Oh, it's gonna be a good day, guys. It's gonna be a great day. <laughs> Yo, look at the space. This is like 10 times the size of the hotel. Woo! Woo! <laughs> James Ellsworth, good morning. How are you? Pretty good. Oh, there's Dink. Wow, look at the space in this place. Right now we're waiting for Hook to come, and the goal is, I'm hoping that Ringside Collectibles exclusive I have, he has not signed yet. Hoping that, you know, this is the first figure he ever signed. Meanwhile... You did get lucky, because I, I did. I <laughs> Big fan of your work in um, TNA. Thank you so much, I appreciate it. Thank You're welcome. You. I'm excited that it's going back to being TNA now. Yeah, uh, you know what? I'm very excited as well, and I'm glad that everyone's quite excited. The video was just amazing. Do you see the one like where we're backstage? Uh, I did you know, with the, the reaction. reaction. Yeah. I did, yeah. Because I know you were in ECW. What was your favorite weapon? Well. To use. <laughs> the most memorable is someone gave me a dildo one time to use. I used it on Guido. Oh, nice. To the head, not somewhere else. <laughs> so now that you guys are out of um, WWE, like, what's the tag? Like, what's your dream tag team like to wrestle? It's still the same as when, um, when we were first. I didn't really, to be honest, I'm going to go Hardy Boys. Oh, Hardy Boys. Up, when I was growing up, I had three favorite wrestlers. Billy Gunn, first yeah. ever favorite wrestler. Don't ask why. Well, no, do ask why. He's fucking sick. <laughs> <laughs> Rob Van Dam and Jeff Hardy. I've wrestled Billy Gunn. I've wrestled Rob Van Dam. Yeah, that would be cool. Yeah, yeah. Get Jeff Hardy in there and I can retire. Hardys as well for you? Yeah, man. I mean, so there's a load, but like... Even like some really obscure ones, like I would love in the United World to wrestle Paul in America. Oh, nice! You know, like, yeah. When I grew up, they were like, I'm a small guy. Yeah. So watching them on the main roster. Mm -hmm. London and Kendrick. Yeah. yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like they were one of my favorite tag teams during like the SmackDown you know era. What I mean? so, like, yeah. For the record, I do actually think I think our money match at the moment is the Young yeah. Bucks. Yeah. Oh, Young Bucks. Yeah. 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 I think like, the chemistry there. That's yeah. Be the That'd be a great center. match. Clash of, clash of styles. But it's styles that uh, complement each other quite yeah. well. So I don't think those are the Young Bucks yeah. are the good. And machine guns. You machine guns. They're yeah, one of my favorites in TNA. Them. You know, all, all of them. them. <laughs> bring them all. <laughs> Stratus is here, baby. So guys, we are currently in line waiting for a hook. We're gonna be getting a couple figures signed from him, and yeah, I'm hoping that this year is the first figure he's signing, you know, to a fan. So let's hope. Oh, you got uh, 
Does that have for you? Do you have like a orange one by any chance? Let's see. So, uh, the first one I saw him was just a little earlier, uh, like, during, you know, the... the so, first fan to get the sign? First fan to get the sign, yeah, bro. Right. Hell yeah, man. You hear that? First time getting the sign. <laughs> First sign for 10? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got you, bro. You want the white? Yeah, I'll do the white All right. on this one. Alright, cool. Guys, we got the first hook figure signed from him as a fan. Let's freaking go. So I have a VIP here. Yeah, your phone. You want to use your phone? Oh. Yeah, you have your phone? Yep, I do. He, you I'm have gonna, yep, I'm going to have him take the picture. Yeah. Yellow for them. Yeah, 
Wow, look at that signature, guys, on that figure. Incredible. No way. <laughs> So what's got to be one of your favorite matches that you've had? The May Young Classic. Yeah. Against Ego. It's probably my favorite one. Oh, Big fan of your work in um, Impact and TNA. Really? Yeah. Oh, so much fun in TNA. Yeah, I went to um last year I actually met um Butcher and Blade at um the Comic Con over there in um, oh Hartford. God. They're How? super nice. Oh good, I'm so glad to hear yeah. that. Yeah, they're the best. They really are. Yep. <laughs> yep, Kineticon. They, they really are the best. Well, that's about the only place too. No, they well no, they pay they pay for the flights.
I know like you're a big um, Bailey fan. What would be your, your favorite match of hers? Use the other one. It's like this. It's like I feel like it's obvious if I do her versus Sasha and it's taking over back Yeah, <laughs> we don't. Have yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, but another one that made me feel like so like I don't know that was like one of the best moments for me was like her versus Eva Marie because I legit Marie, thought yeah. she was gonna lose. It was like. It was at full sale, but that one, like, that was like the best feeling as a wrestling fan. Like, I thought she was gonna lose. Like, it was all the emotions. It was one of pro wrestling match should have been. Yeah, it's awesome though to see that you're getting into it too now. Yeah, yeah, I'm like full time now. I love it. Are you guys having fun today? Pretty fun, yeah. Yeah. Good Who else time. did you meet? Oh, I'm. Happy birthday, Ben. This is Paul London. I know. Regardless of that, I hope you're having a great birthday. Sorry you couldn't be here. It's a big event, blah, 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 whatever the name of it also is. Uh, but I got this, and I think we're gonna hopefully set something up, and I would love to come on to your show. I'm in posing now, actually. I haven't actually been invited yet, but I, I would like to come on the show. If you could make some time for me, please. Uh, oh, absolutely. So, happy birthday, and uh, we'll talk soon. So what's got to be like one of your like favorite like rivalries that you had? Uh, me versus The Office. <laughs> uh, I had some really like a series of matches. I don't even know. If, maybe it's like a competitive rivalry. Like uh, Jimmy Jimmy Yang Wang and I. We had such a, a flow to how we work with and against each other. Because um, they're very physical matches. Yeah. You know, we beat the tar out of each other, but you can only really do that with certain people. Yeah, and one of my favorites that was with you was um, you and Billy Kidman. Okay. Well, I really no enjoyed mercy. that. No Mercy, one. yeah. And I had a broken nose in that match. I know, that's Before crazy. That, there's, a, there's some point in that match when he gives me a football punt right in my face. Mm -hmm. I'm like, you motherfucker. You know, <laughs> yeah. Uh, look at him. Um, so, you know, thank you. That was a fun oh, match, except the, the ridiculous cherry juice bullshit they yeah. put in my mouth at the end. I'm like, this is the fakest blood I've ever seen in my life. Yeah. Are you out of here, sir? Yes. Absolute pleasure. Say hello. D-O-N. N. N. Don. She said Don the West. I was like, oh. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to put it over here. That's why I'm waiting until it dies down and then sneak there, sneak in there towards the end. <laughs> Don't wait too long. Yeah, no, I'm not going to wait too long. I'm excited though for TNA to come back. Me too. I stand by. I feel like it'll bring more like eyes back to the product and stuff. Me too. And it's such, like, it's such an iconic chant. Yeah. <laughs> so if you had to pick like any like knockout like in the history of TNA, like who would you like want to wrestle? This is a difficult question for me. <laughs> so I think. Because of how much she inspired me, and I do yeah. use a modified version for finish with Rosemary, is that even though I, Courtney, has wrestled Nikki Rocks, yeah. I think Rosemary would love to wrestle with Roxy. <laughs> that would be cool. <laughs> So I do got to ask you, Rob, Bob, on your old theme song, Just Look At Me, what was your thoughts on that? <laughs> I thought that it would be a great song for somebody else. <laughs> <laughs> Just look at me. 
and then there as well. Can you do the blue on that? What do we got over here? A cup of haters? We got a cup of haters? Absolutely not. That's some more, Ray. It's all love. Bada boom, real is one in a room. How you doing? And I got bada boom, the realest podcast in a room. This guy, best one, Donnie. Certified G, bona fide stud. Can't teach that. Not at any learning institution. Don't even try. But if you stay tuned, listen to the podcast, best one, Donnie might teach you a thing or two about a thing or two. And one thing Donnie here is not, he's SAWFT soft. And if you're tuned out, you are. Alrighty guys, we are in the line for good old mommy. We met everybody else now. It's the waiting game to get this sign. So yeah, it's gonna be a long time. One hour later. We are closer to the line for good old mommy. several days later. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this long vlog. I got the opportunity to meet so many wrestlers and honestly, compared to the last big event, New York, that was held at the hotel back in March, this one was way more organized. I got to give, you know, a huge shout out to, you know, all the vendors and of course Tom and his entire team for putting on, you know, such an incredible event. And I really hope that we continue to get more, you know, wrestling conventions at the same place. I felt like this was, you know, a really good convention. But guys, if you enjoyed the vlog, make sure to smash that like button now. If you're not a best one yet already, subscribe, turn on the post notifications. The link's down in the description below. You can go follow me over on my social medias and other YouTube pages. All that down below. If you want to see a haul of everything I got signed, I have a whole separate video over on the Best One Donnie channel where, you know, I document and rebuild my toy collection. So there's a whole nother video there. But, of course, all the best ones. And we are Wrestling Maniacs out there worldwide. We are taking over. Peace.